Fresno students at Bishop State Community College were shocked when they were told that their program was being closed. They said they had barely gotten notice from the college and want more communication. I spoke with them earlier today about it. The administration here, we've tried to reach out to them. They will not comment to us. We're not getting any information that we need from them. Ronnie Lambert is enrolled at Bishop State in the Funeral Services Program. That program, along with sign language, civil engineering technology, plumbing, and jewelry design and watch repair are being closed at the end of the semester. Lambert says this affects the entire community. Established business in the funeral home industry for 100 miles from here. It's produced owners, operators, and they just, they're just not being fair to us. They say all the information they got was an unsigned memo and have tried to get in touch with the president or vice president of the college to no avail. They claim the correct protocol is not being followed here. I reached out to the college who said they are striving to use their resources wisely and invest them in programs that return the greatest dividends for students, employees, and taxpayers. A statement goes on to read, in consultation with the Alabama Community College System leadership, Bishop State has in recent months evaluated its programs and identified those that were less successful based on student enrollment, operational costs and efficiencies, and industry workforce needs. But these students don't believe that this was a financial decision. College officials say this will only affect 27 students, but Lambert blames low enrollment numbers on a lack of advertising. If they're going to close it, it needs to be brought before the students, before the, the faculty, and, and sit down and talk about it. Don't just get up in the office and sit there and say, okay, we're closing it and not involve anybody. Lambert and others were told they will only get a, sem a summer semester to finish out all the remaining courses they need to graduate, but an official with the college told me today they are in the middle of creating a plan for all students to be given enough time to finish out their program. They just won't be enrolling any new students. Four faculty members were also affected by the closures.